Hello everyone, and welcome to um, a thing I haven't done recently. <laughs> um, uh, I keep meaning to do these, like, I'm like way too close to the microphone. Um, I keep meaning to do these every month at the beginning of the month, but I end up missing out in doing them in some way or other. Um, but yeah, this is a channel update to let you guys know what is gone on, what is uh, coming up, um, and things like that. <laughs> um, I'm trying a bit of a different uh, system here. Um, in fact, let me actually go ahead and change this for now. Um, but I've got the, uh, as you can see, I've got the, uh, the patrons, um, scrolling down there at the bottom of the screen. Um, there we go. That also hides the taskbar by doing that. <laughs> um, that looks better. Uh, but yeah, this is a new thing that I'm going to try doing, um, in upcoming episodes. Um, I'm going to, because I ha always have my, uh, my patrons supporting me over there on Patreon, and I feel like I need to give them more, you know, credit and view and stuff like that. And so another, uh, YouTuber I saw was doing this. They just had the, uh, the patrons at the bottom of the screen scrolling like that throughout the uh, the video. Um, so I'm thinking about doing something similar that way they're always up there. Um, that said, uh, if you do want to help out, um, you can support me over here on Patreon. Um, it currently says three, but that's because uh, Mel Kent that Duffy there, his payment never seems to go through until like the fourth. I don't know why that is. It, it always goes through, so that's why I keep him on the uh, the list every time. <laughs> um, but yeah, you can help support the channel by coming over here on Patreon. It really does help. You get sneak peeks of the webcomic Life of Alexis Perkins. Um, you get early access to various things beyond that. Um, based on how much you're donating, even one dollar, like, you know, I mean, if nothing else, for one dollar, your name appears on everything this Patreon, Patreon goes to, and that's Life of Alexis Perkins, that's my YouTube channel, and things like that, so, I mean, it, it really does help me out, you know, that's the one dollar a month. I mean, that's, <laughs> that's $12 a year, so it's really not that much when you think about it. Um, so it, it really is super helpful. There's always a link to my Patreon in the video descriptions down below. Um, and so if you want to get your name on the videos, um, you can uh, help support me through Patreon. Also, uh, as you may have noticed, uh, the last couple of months, I've been doing Pokemon Sapphire, and I don't think I have that listed immediately up here because I've been uploading Rhythm Thief and Breath of the Wild. Um, but here I've got 12 episodes to Pokemon Sapphire, and these have all been, um, I actually have been missing to name all of them properly, but it's all been a Patreon request from the Gentlemanly Rake. And that's been great. Um, you can gain that. Yeah, I will record two hours of gameplay of that game per month for $10 and up. You can also get multiplayer sessions if we can work together to figure out how to do that. Or you can even get up to four hours of the original request time. Um, Gentlemanly Rake actually did that a while ago where he... Um, helped out by, uh, he, uh, he requested, I think it was Super Mario Maker, but then he was also doing the 15 at the time, and so he was, uh, 
it, he got to do like multiplayer with like I think it was Pokemon Battle Revolution that he chose so that was cool um, that was just something that he wanted and so that's what I uh, did for him <laughs> um, that said um, so what are the plans for this month and what have we been doing um, I actually haven't been editing my uh, front list here um, but what we have been doing lately <clears throat> is a lot of Breath of the Wild and a lot of Rhythm Thief and the Emperor's Treasure. Uh, there are 21 episodes to Rhythm Thief and then that will be done. Um, 20 regular episodes and then one bonus episode where I went in and did the extra content that's at the end of the game. Um, I'm thinking I might do an episode like that for Breath of the Wild as well because there's some things that can't actually be done until you've completed the game once. Um, so I might do like a couple bonus episodes for Breath of the Wild as well. Um, that said, Breath of the Wild is coming along amazingly. Um, we have 85 episodes pre-recorded here. It is getting to be a very long series. And so I have been really excited about that. Um, we're probably going to be doing that for another couple of months because of that. Because we're only on, what, the, today's episode is, cause, or not today's episode. Um, time of recording this is May 3rd. So today, in that regard, is episode 42. But the episode that went up today, as in T um, when this episode is going up is episode 46, 45, it looks like. Yeah, that's right, because I'm doing this, because this is going to be going up on May 6th, so it's going to be episode 45 that goes up. Um, so, I mean, episode 45, that's uh, how, many, how many hours after is that? It's another... Well, I guess it doesn't uh, want to tell me, because usually it tells me when I do that. Well, it's another 25 gigabytes of video. There you go. Another 22 hours of video. At half an hour each. I think that'll last us just to that point. Another, like, two months, basically. Um, I don't really care to do the math right now, but yeah. <laughs> I mean, four, 85 is another 40 days at least so uh yeah i guess that would be another 40 days right there a month and a half um and we'll easily reach the episode 100 on breath of the wild i think so we'll should easily have enough to last through both june and july and even then um because probably by then the dlc will be out and so of course then i'll have to <laughs> Uh, record that as well, so probably won't be uh, finishing that up anytime soon. Um, on the other hand, after that, uh, what I've already decided, and I mentioned this, um, obviously you won't hear it until um, the last episode of Rhythm Thief, the bonus episode, but I mentioned on that one that my plans are to move back into Snake Pass. Uh, I did five episodes of that, and then I really wanted to play Rhythm Thief, so I went and played that for a while. Um, another series that I do want to do is, you know how we did Pokemon Moon? Um, I want to do a Sun Nuzlocke, and I've already recorded a couple episodes of that. I'm not sure when those episodes will be going up, though, so no guarantees that that will be anytime soon. Um, especially since that will require me to reformat my, uh, recording. Because I started that, because that's what I wanted to do. And then I mentioned something about Rhythm Thief during one of these episodes, and I was like, oh, I want to go play that now. And so that was when I recorded Rhythm Thief. <laughs> and so I didn't want to start four, uh, put up four episodes of Pokemon Sun just to turn around and then put up Rhythm Thief. And then go back to Snake Bass and then finally come back to 
uh, Pokemon Sun again. Um, but the other thing is that uh, I don't currently know because uh, the gentlemanly rake hasn't told me yet because I haven't asked them because I usually wait until all the uh, finances have processed over here on Patreon before I message anybody and say, hey, you can do your, what What do you want for your request now, you know? And I'm going to guess that he's going to do more Pokemon Sapphire. And if that's the case, then tomorrow, as in the day after this episode goes up, um, the slot that is currently Rhythm Thief will be taken up by uh, another six episodes of Pokemon Sapphire. Which then we'll come back to Rhythm Thief again, and then finally into Snake Pass. Uh, so that's going to take a little while. <laughs> um, so hopefully nobody was like, oh, I need to see Snake Pass, you know, because it could be a little while before we get back to that. Um, but if you haven't seen Rhythm Thief and the Emperor's Treasure yet, um, I highly recommend it. It's a really awesome rhythm game. It's a lot of fun. I totally enjoyed playing it. Um, I used this as my uh, thumbnail for it because Marie is like my favorite character. And so um, I, I just really like the Rhythm Thief game, Rhythm Thief and the Emperor's Treasure. Um, I have not played Paris Caper, which is I guess like the iOS version of Rhythm Thief and the Emperor's Treasure. It's basically the same game, but like on iOS and has like a completely different mechanic for like doing the different levels and stuff. Um, but I mean, it's a rhythm game, you know, and it's a lot of fun. So if you like rhythm games, uh, feel free to check that out because that's uh, a pretty good series if I do say so myself. Um, let's see. What else is there to say? <laughs> um, not too much. That was what I did. That's what I'm planning to still do. Um, got Pokemon Sapphire, probably Rhythm Thief, um, Snake Pass, more Breath of the Wild, of course, because I'm thoroughly enjoying Breath of the Wild, even though Nintendo hates me posting Breath of the Wild. Because, I mean, look at this. Copyright content, copyright content, copyright content. It's been real annoying. Almost half of the episodes have been copyright stricken. Um, or copyright claimed. Not really copyright stricken. Because I haven't gotten a strike. I've just gotten a, um, you know, includes copyright content, copyright claim. So, I haven't been able to really monetize most of those. But, I... At the moment, I'm not really doing it for the money. I'm doing it because it's fun. So it's not that big of a deal. I would like to make this my job at some point, but I have a lot of other projects in the works to try and actually earn me money um, beyond just Patreon. Um, speaking of Patreon um, and the other projects, uh, I am actually writing a novel. It's called... Uh, Dragon Wars, Birth of the Dragon Men. Uh, and I have, I'll go ahead and show you this image of it. First Me Tales of Dragon War. Um, this was back when I was still working with the tentative title, but these are the main characters of the novel. Um, I will be posting sometime between when I record this and when I post this a preview of the novel, the very first chapter of it, um, which introduces the two main, two of these two main characters here. Um, I will be posting that specifically to Patreon. Um, it will be, I think it's like a five dollar thing, because it's uh, individual chapters of any stories I'm writing, and that's uh, five dollars. So gain access to the individual chapters and I will be posting one, maybe two preview chapters because I feel like the first chapter doesn't really like set the tone for how the rest of the book is going to go. Um, it's really the second novel where things start picking up, but the first chapter is always like introducing people. Um, 
So with that, um, if you're interested in checking out my novel, um, you can also donate through Patreon and that will allow you access to the first chapter or two of the novel. Um, uh, the, the full novel will obviously be coming out and you can go out and purchase it and stuff like that, of course, but that's going to involve after I find a publisher and things, which I still haven't done. Um, but that'll happen some point. <laughs> uh, I would love to show you more of the novel, but uh, I guess if you want to know more, you'll just have to check out my Patreon and go from there. Um, so that said, uh, I do think that's about all that there is to say. Um, again, uh, thanks to the patrons that are that have the name scrolling here at the bottom of the video. Um, leave a comment. Let me know what you think of the whole scrolling thing. I'm trying to figure out ways of putting people's names on my videos, like at all times. Because until I can make this my job, I can't really stop and do editing. So I can't like put up an end slate that has people's names and stuff like that. Because I also have to work and then I'm working on my novel and I'm actually doing game development. And needless to say, my days are basically full at all times. Um, YouTube is actually what I do to unwind and relax from all of the other stuff that I do because otherwise if I didn't have YouTube and playing games and stuff so that you guys could watch and enjoy I honestly could say that I really wouldn't have any relaxation time during the week so that's why I like to record YouTube stuff I've also been relaxing a bit probably a bit more than I should be uh, you know, 85 episodes of Breath of the Wild and 21 episodes, the whole, the entire game of Rhythm Thief. And yeah, I have, I like to keep a stock of episodes. This happened with Pokemon Moon though, by the way, Pokemon Moon, the blind run. Like, I don't, I'm not even kidding you. When I did Pokemon Moon, like, I started posting them, like, one day, one each day and everything. And this was before I went to the whole two slots. And I remember, because I had, like, I had done up to, like, episode 60 or somewhere around here. And, um, you know, I had just posted, like, episode 6 or 7 or something like that. And I'm like, um... Yeah, this is going to be a really long series. So I started posting two videos and then like, I was like, I need to unwind. And so that's when I started recording. I don't remember what it was, what else it was that I was recording at the time. Um, I know that at one point I did like Super Princess Peach. Um, I didn't finish that, but I remember that at one point I started doing that and stuff. Um, I don't remember what else I was doing at the same time as Pokemon Moon, but uh, oh yeah, that's right. I was doing like Fallen Sage and Times Menagerie and stuff like that. Um, but that was later on. I don't remember what I was doing early on. Um, actually, Fallen Sage has gotten a lot of views. I'm very surprised by that. Um, I don't think Times Menagerie has been doing as well. But that's all right. Oh yeah, look at this. I was posting literally two episodes of Pokemon Move Moon a day for like a long time because I was just like yeah I just have so many episodes of this um yeah so you can see why I started doing it was right there so and then yeah so it was Fallen Sage that I immediately went to for the second because like I need to unwind and do something and like somebody had messaged me on YouTube they're like hey are you ever gonna do like Fallen Sage and Times of Menagerie because I had done like, I have the like video of me beating Majora on the live stream. They're like, are you ever gonna do like the full series? And I'm like, I would love to, but I've never actually like found the games. You know, they, they've just been missing since then. And so I haven't been able to refine the games. And so the guy linked me 
to both Fallen Sage and Times Menagerie, which was great. Um, so I used that to unwind during my weeks up until I had finished Times Menagerie. So, and after that, that was when I was like, okay, I've been doing two different series for a long time now, so I'll just keep up this whole two different series thing. And that's where I am today. <laughs> doing two different series like I have been. Um, so I do hope that you guys have been enjoying what I've been putting up. I know that it hasn't seemed like Breath of the Wild has gotten nearly as many views as like Pokemon Moon was getting. Um, clearly nowhere near as many views as I guess my currently most watched series I guess. Freaking Fallen Sage over here with regular like 15 plus views in most episodes. Well, I mean, here's a 77 views on episode 49, so that's pretty good. Um, I guess Pokemon Moon was really popular <laughs> during December at least. Um, yeah, because now the views have dwindled down on Fallen Sage. They actually seem to be going up as you go further into Pokemon Moon. I don't understand that. Why does that happen? Like, wouldn't you want to watch from the beginning? Like, why would you, you know, the 10 views on 50, but why is there 14 on 51, you know? Or wouldn't you have wanted to watch 50 and 49 and 48? And 48's got five, and then the next one has 77. I mean, <laughs> I don't really understand that, you know? Eh, oh well, what can you do? Anyway... I hope that you have enjoyed this channel update. Uh, I really do want to try doing these more, like every month. Um, also, uh, again, feel free to check out my Patreon. That is in the link just below. Um, or there's a link below in the video description. Seriously, I know how to outro. <laughs> and uh, I guess with that, I'll see you guys next time. See you later.